Okay, so let's start by completing the table below. Our expression is 8 tenths divided by 4. So you're looking at the model, and then at the bottom it says number of groups. Well, the number of groups is going to be your divisor. So it's showing us that 4 is our divisor, and 8 tenths is our dividend. So that's what we need to divide equally. So before we um, divide, using a model, we first need to represent 8 tenths. So let's do that now. I'm going to do that in yellow. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And that's 8 tenths. So I know that 4 can go into 8 two times, right? And I'm going to have four even groups of two. So that must mean two tenths. So here's my first group. Here's my second group. My third group. And then my fourth group is in yellow. So our quotient is going to be the um, the number that's in each group. So I have two tenths, so I must put my decimal to represent the tenths. Very good. All right, let's represent 72 hundredths divided by three. So we know that we're gonna have three groups. The three is our divisor and 72 hundredths is our dividend. So let's represent that first. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and 2 hundredths. All right, I'm going to need three even groups. Now, you can do this on a sheet of paper, but I can look and see that 3 goes into 7 how many times? Well, 2, right? 2. 2 times 3 is 6. 7 minus 6, well, that'll be 1. And if I bring down my 2, I'll have 12. 3 goes into 12 four times. So I'm going to need to create a group of 24 hundredths. So there's 2 tenths, 1, 2, 3, 4 hundredths. I'm going to use um, orange. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So that would be 1 tenth. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And then I need 1, 2, 3, 4 hundredths. Okay, and then my third group will be in yellow. And you'll see I have two tenths and then four hundredths shaded. So I have three even groups and within each group I have 24 hundredths. I hope this helped. Have a great day.